Celebrations to mark World Water Day in Cameroon coincides with the presence of a multinational corporation in the country. A multinational corporation which unionists of the water sector say they are monitoring very closely so that the government of Cameroon should not entrust its water services to. Yes, we have uh, uh, Veolia who is insisting to come in. Although Veolia is working with the government of Cameroon, they will have an eye on what they are doing. We'll be monitoring their movement so that we'll make sure they don't move from where they are to another step. Because if they move to another step, to another step, it will not be to the privilege of Carbonians. They will go back to the privatization. It would not be a good thing for Carbonians. And we're working on that. So we're pleading the government, pleading the parliamentarians, pleading the civil society, pleading all the officials to come along with us so that we keep this social amenity within the hands of Cameroonians. I will make sure that it works. Because the, the, the problem is not only to keep in water in the hands of Cameroonians, the problem is that the Cameroonians who are running the, 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 the business should make everything possible so that Cameroonians will have access to water in quality and in quantity. Water activists hold strongly that multinational corporations only seek to exploit water needs for profit. Water unionists and activists are strongly advocating for public ownership and control of water. Water is a national resource that belongs to Cameroonians, that belongs to citizens. It is even a strategic commodity. When we say strategic commodity, it means health, good health depends on good water. So if you give this thing, these facilities to a foreigners or multinationals, they would render the, the facility into something which is commercial. And water is not for sale. We have this power that says water is life. If water is life, then it is not a foreigner who will handle your life. It is you yourself who have to handle your life. So we continue to advocate that. And we're making seminars, making meetings to synthesize the public that they should know the privilege of having water within our jerome. Because water should not be something that is managed by foreigners. Because when foreigners take over, they come in to make profit, not to make social, not to offer social amenities to workers, to, 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 to citizens. So that's why we are saying that the government of Cameroon should make all it's possible to avoid this problem of privatization. This year's World 